through our Park Tower camera, overcast skies here in the valley. We got a little break here, but we got more rain in the forecast. I'll show you some numbers, though, on the board this Thursday afternoon. 62 in Sacramento, 66 for Stockton, 63 for Modesto. We got 56 right now up in South Lake Tahoe. So Pretty mild temperatures outside with humidity up to 84 percent, dew point at 57. We got our winds right now pretty light though from the east southeast, six miles per hour, and a pressure right now 30.10. Checking in with our CBS 13 weather watchers, we got 62 degrees. This is Matt out in Woodland, also reporting overcast skies. And then we head out towards Vacaville. This is James right here, 59 degrees, and he's actually excited, saying loving the return of moisture in the Vacaville hills. All right, we definitely need the rain, but we are going to get a lot of it. Let's show you though some uh, numbers here as we head into. To your valley hourly forecast. We have the chance for a few more isolated light showers to uh, pick up again this afternoon between 2 and 4 o'clock. After that, we get a nice little break here, but notice our temperature still below average, getting into the low 70s here in the valley at around 4 o'clock today with partly cloudy skies as we head into your overnight hours. Now, here's a look at the bigger picture. The prefrontal showers ahead of this strong storm system right here is already impacting the Pacific Northwest. We're going to pick up the tail, of, uh, tail end of it, and it is going to be moving over us again overnight. Night tonight into early tomorrow morning. As we zoom in closer, though, to see where the rain is falling right now, the valley and out towards the Bay Area starting to dry out right now, but it is bringing the rain showers up into portions of the foothills. We've even got some areas with some uh, moderate rainfall totals uh, up into the Sierra. So that's going to be the case throughout the afternoon today. Again, by 3 34 o'clock, we get a nice little band pushing in, but then we clear out in the overnight hours. But by tomorrow morning, get ready. This is 520 on our future cast here. The rain moves in for the coast and along towards the Delta, Vacaville, and Fairfield, and then eventually just makes its way into the valley, the foothills, and up in the Sierra. It is going to be a quick carrier, though. By tomorrow afternoon, it finally pushes out of the way. Not before, though, dumping some snow up in the higher elevations. Pretty high up, though. We're looking at snow levels to start off at 9,000 feet. And then once it heads off towards the east, it'll drop down to 7,000 feet. But we will be dry by Friday afternoon. It's going to set things up for a pretty soggy Saturday. Not quite as heavy as the rain that we are expecting, though, by Sunday. That one's going to be a big one. As far as our winds go, this afternoon, south winds anywhere from 10 to 20 miles per hour. The winds increase tomorrow morning. We could see some wind gusts up in the higher elevations, up to 40 miles per hour. And that's just an indication that the storm has arrived. Now, as far as the numbers go with this first round, we'll get about a half inch into the valley. Closer to an inch and a half into Grass Valley, but I'm going to fast forward all the way through early next week, and that is what we could see numbers here in the valley pushing closer to four, possibly five inches. We may even see up to eight inches when it is all said and done up into the high country. So, yes, a lot of rain will be coming down, but in a short amount of time. So, that flash flood watch will be in place for burn scar areas. And we could even see some ponding and flooding into uh, your neighborhood as well. So, be sure to clear out the gutters when you can. For our daytime highs today, though, still below average. We'll be in the upper 60s for Marysville, low 70s here in Sacramento. A little bit warmer, though, out towards Modesto. And then seven day forecast temperatures will remain in the 60s, but we'll see some heavy rain tomorrow, a little break on Saturday, and even heavier showers Sunday into Monday. We got more coming up right here on CBS 13 at noon. Stay with us. We'll be right back.